Hey yo, it's the morning as of the recording of this video. I didn't even know this was dropping today or anything like that. I stayed away from the information for this because I wanted to be, to be surprised when I get it. However, you already know what it is. It's time for a reaction. Devil May Cry 5 gameplay. Apparently it's all Dante. I don't know how true that is, but let's get into this. Get these headphones on. Let's go. Turn that up a little bit. So, that's the Devil May Cry store. Okay. I'm loving the Dante look. So, Trickster, Swordmaster. Yeah. Ah, ah, okay. Beowulf. What were those dodges? Some new moves. Alright. Oh. Lady. Trish. What, what is this? Okay. Bro oh, okay. I like this. That looks like an enemy that you've seen Devil Cry 4. Yes, I get to see it with my own eyes. What are you seeing? Dante. Oh. I'm gonna go too. Which one wants to play? Okay, so we're getting more Haha! <laughs> I love that dropkick from the first uh well, Devil Cry 4 when he first does it. I think he does it to Dante as well. I, right I mean it does have a lot of power. Yeah, it does. I don't see her calling Dante Soldier Boy. Ooh, more of this. <laughs> yes. I like this. Yo, that double trigger is serious. What? That's nice. What is that? Jackpot. That's a very angry jackpot. That's it. New he who desires but act not breeds pestilence. Okay. So it is written. Anything after? Anything after? Can I, can I give us more? Hey, there it is. I got a new arm for ya. A <laughs> oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Alright, that's the end of the trailer. Now we see everyone. Okay. Alright, let's um let's break it down. Did I like the trailer? Yeah, I actually really enjoyed the trailer. The The song worked really well. I just saw someone post and say that they weren't a fan of the lyrics. I didn't really care much for the lyrics or anything. It, what, the beat instrumental went really well with the, the trailer and pretty much a, a, a Dante theme. And it was, I really enjoyed that. That gave us so much information in the terms of the gameplay aspect, which is the point, it's a gameplay trailer. And that's just really cool. But in terms of the story, we know that Trish is going to be in there as of the trailer. We know that Lady is going to be in there. So those are two characters that have been prominent in Dante's life from pretty much the beginning of um, his Devil May Cry career since he started up the business because that sounds back to um, Devil May Cry 3 where we first meet a lady, uh, well, a woman by the name of Lady because that's what she's called because Dante just calls her that and then we eventually find out her name is Mary and I think the dude, her dad's name is Arkham and he sacrificed himself to become more like a demon, blah, 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 blah. So that's really cool. Like, I think her personality is a bit more upbeat in this one as opposed to being more business-like as she was in 3. Um, well, she was very upset in 3 with everything. She was a very angsty character. And then in Devil May Cry 4, she was um, a bit more business-like with a bit more jokes along the lines of um, Dante, but not as carefree. And we've got Trish, who was originally 
sent out to um, kill Dante by Mundus, Mundus, however you want to say his name. Um, and that's just super, super cool. That's made me happy. Um, she she looks really cool. You didn't really get to see many of her powers um, in there, but she's mad powerful. Lady still has her um, rocket launcher, and that, that's awesome. I'm very, very happy with that. As for Dante's game, he's using a motorbike to fight. That is awesome. Um, at the end of it, though, you did see um, it's a uh, Mega Man's arm, Buster Arm. Is it his Buster Arm? I think that's what it's called. But that's really cool because Mega Man is made by Capcom. I wonder when they're going to make a new Mega Man game that people are actually going to like. But that's a story for another day. But as for, like I said, the story, um, the new character, who's I think his name is V. But people were saying that's Virgil. I'm not quite sure. Like I said, I've avoided information. But I might have to get back into this information trip for um, De Devil May Cry 5. But he, I think he's going to be a new playable character. Um, from what I heard in the original stuff that there there might be a, a third playable character going around on the internet. So you've got Dante, um, Nero, obviously, and this new character who is by the name of V. We're going to see what's going on. I'm interested to see what his gameplay is like because I don't see any weapons. He's got a book. He might be one of those characters that uses his book to fight and then create um, other clones of himself or shadow versions of himself or create weapons out of these scrolls, these books, and everything like that. So that might be interesting. I'm going to do some research, see what I can find. If I find anything interesting, expect to see a video about it. But anyways, dudes, I'm very happy with this trailer. I'm very happy with the way the gameplay looks. The story aspect of this, with this new guy being a client, probably undercover of some sort, it, it just looks really interesting. That interaction between, Twan Twante, <laughs> between Dante and Nero is highly interesting to me. I just can't wait to see what happens in terms of the story of finding out who Nero really is in respect to the, the Sparta family with uh, Virgil and Dante. Is Virgil alive? I mean, we didn't see anything about him in this trailer, but we'll see. Anyways, dudes, leave a like, subscribe, comment. Let me know if you enjoyed this video, what else you want to see, all that good stuff. Most importantly, hit that notification bell because it lets you know when I'm posting a video, which I do weekly, um, mainly, mainly once, twice, three times. You know, I, I like to be consistent. But anyways, dudes, I still don't have a sign-off, so, um, peace.